conservative on the block. I was born to a very conservative family. I was a homeschool kid back in the 80s and 90s, and I was listening to Rush Limbaugh ever since I was 10 years old. So I am a confirmed conservative. And I've been thinking of doing a YouTube channel for a long time, but I was concerned about everyone getting, oh, banned, banned, banned. But I've seen a lot of channels I really enjoy, a lot of conservative channels that are still going strong, so I figure there is room for me. So here I am. I had planned to start this channel, you know, maybe in a month or two, after hearing about the arrest of Tommy Robinson and about how the British people are threatened with jail for speaking. I am horrified. And I said, I need to start this channel immediately, immediately, and see what I can do to help, even if it's only to help boost their morale. Just help to say something. Somebody who has some free speech, still. Even if it's, even if it's just to say, come to America. Have some freedom. I mean, but it's, it's still a serious problem. I mean, they're... they're these countries are still going to have to get their act together and what they're doing now is not working. And if the authorities think they're going to hang on to their power and their money by oppressing the people and shutting down the presses, it's not going to work. It never has worked and it will not work this time. They will just land themselves in prison eventually. Dictators typically have a very short shelf life. So they need to think about that. Dictators have a short shelf life. It's best to be honest and truthful and work with your people instead of oppressing them. Oppressing people is never a good choice.